Alright, let me see if I can do the side mission. I don't think I can, but... I mean, the thing is, is that we do have falter and recovery things, so I'm not sure why... We can't do this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mission prep. Yeah, look. Fulton system. It's here. Like, the Fulton system. It's here. Yeah, it's just not letting me do it. Okay. Target practice, target no limit. Practice. As a special treat, you can practice freely on any of the targets in the shooting range today. Shoot Ooh. away. When you're done, head over to the exit. Ooh, we can do... We can do some, like, target practice stuff? Okay, cool, cool, cool. What are you talking about? I have weapons. They are equipped. What do you mean? I don't understand why it's not letting me do this. Hi. So I guess the side missions are just borked. I guess they're just bugged. Which I mean kinda sucks, but whatever. The direction Amanda sent in east is we're going. Yep. Mission prep. I want to start the mission, but there's some things that I, I want the R&D of that pistol to be done is the problem. Yeah, it's literally taking forever. Unless I have to like play a mission to make it go. I guess that's the case. All right, whatever. We'll just do the mission. Hopefully the R&D gets better. I'm gonna try to use the suppressor as sparingly as physically possible. Okay. Let's go, baby. By the way, in case you guys can't see, you guys can't see it because I'm in the way, but there is a Peace Walker loading screen thingy right there. You just can't see it because I'm kind of in the way. Okay. Careful. They've got reinforcements coming. We're just going to chill here. Enemies close. You didn't hear or see shit. You right. Huh? I think I see someone. What is it? Get up! What is it? Okay, I got him. guy went but
Oh, there he is, too. Hmm. Damn, brother. Okay, I think I got everyone, so I guess we can just go explore now. A little bit. Do we have anything in here? Nope. Okay. Coolio, what about in here? Nope, can't go in there. Alright, so where do we need to go? We gotta go back. You know what? Let's go back this way. Whew. I think both these places go back to the same place, yeah? Yeah, okay. I don't think we went to the jungle yet, so let's go back to the jungle. We ha I don't think we've gone to the jungle. And then we'll loop back to the ravine, and then we'll go north of the ravine. Let's check out what the jungle has. Oh, this is the jungle. Okay, right, 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 right. So we've we've definitely been to the jungle. Okay, so we've definitely been here at the jungle. Going on. Goodbye, sir. Yeah, see, this is rough. I should have, I should have CQC'd. Can I restart my mission? Restart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I, I, I want to like have suppressor, man. Like, I need to have suppressor. Is the problem? Okay, so yeah, we know that these guys are coming in. Hello, gentlemen. And now we know to not go immediately to the door. And now we know to not go there. About to say, don't tell me he comes over here. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Down you go. Get fucked, NPC. Yeah, pretty yep. much. Yep. Come on, choke <sighs> out, buddy. There we go. Let me let him fall. What was that? I'm seeing things. You are, man. Isn't that crazy? This guy better not see me, I swear to god. Come on, choke out, buddy. Alright, 
Alright, now you just gotta go look the other way. How long this takes. I feel like that could be way shorter, but whatever. Okay, let's go into the jungle. Do it much better this time, much better this time without losing like my entire fucking suppressor. I want to see somebody make like, uh, make um, a cool like mod pack like a weapon mod pack for zombies that's just Metal Gear stuff. So I'm gonna see like the starting pistol be like a fucking 1911 like normal zombies but then have like a Mark 22 hush puppy. It, it, there's essentially like a bolt action pistol where like, I mean it's not gonna be non-lethal obviously but it'd be cool if like it, it kind of filled a similar role to like the Black Ops 1 Python if you know what I mean by that. Wait. Uh oh. Can't be imagining things. How did he know? I have a feeling I might have to shoot this guy, chat. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, wait, hold on. Huge. I heard something. They heard you. They're gonna come take a look. Can't be imagining things. The enemy's here! God damn it. They spotted you. Get out of there. Let's get Good. the fuck out of here. Shook They're still looking, though. Don't make it easy for them. Uh, do I have a ration? Yes. I would like to use a ration. Thank you, big man. That's fucking annoying. Um, so what is- so the- not the binos, the... No, yeah, the binos, right? No. Maybe I'm just dumb. Maybe I need to equip it. I think I need to equip it when I play. Oh, that's the wrong way. Wait, is it the wrong way? Hold on. Yeah, that was the wrong way. We gotta go... No, wait. Do we? No. Um... We gotta go to the ravine. Is this the ravine? Yeah, it's the ravine. Okay. Jesus, get fucked, NPC. Get fucked, NPC! Get fucked, nerd! Fuck you, idiot! Amanda went across that rope bridge. Hurry! Start talking. Uh huh. Start talking. All right. Time for you to go down. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. There we go. Look at you being a nice person. Room, huh? We'll keep it here at the base. Hey. Thanks for the 556, five, buddy. Hey, look, a rope. be able to get past the enemy by hanging from the bridge. Press the action button near the bridge's Or we just do this. Hey, buddy. Start talking. Start talking. Start talking. Okay. Then, uh, we'll just go ahead and do this, then. 
Now, chat, the biggest thing we have to remember about this game, right, is that this is not a main title in terms of, like, it's a Metal Gear game, but it doesn't... This came out on PSP, so we have to remember the limitations of the PSP while playing this. This game is essentially Metal Gear Solid 5 before Metal Gear Solid 5. Okay, here we go. New uncharted territory. It's the other side of the river, it looks like. I don't see any other guards around, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab this guy. Hello. How's it going, buddy? Uh oh, hurry up, hurry up, please, hurry up, please, hurry up, please, hurry up, please. Hurry up and choke, please. Stay out of the water. That's beyond the scope of this operation. Can't be imagining things. What's going on? There must be. <laughs> Hi, buddy. How's it going? Start talking. Start talking. Start talking. Uh huh. Well, you're going down just like your friend. Oh, okay. Now, can I take my suppressor off of this? No, you cannot take the suppressor off of this. I can drop some ammo, though. If there's anything you want to know, just give me a call on the radio. Press the start button to open the menu window. Then choose the radio call option. Aha, uh -huh. see? I'm glad I crouched. There's another guy around here. <laughs> nope. Hello. Start talking. <laughs> I don't think you want to kill me? Okay. Start talking. What's this? Start talking. Okay. If aiming's too difficult, use auto aim. <laughs> okay, here we go. Sorting shed. Careful now. They might be holding FSLN soldiers prisoner. Huh. I know about salt and recovery system. The question is, where am I meant to be going right now? Okay, there's a prisoner. I see this lad. And there's also a guard here. See if I can. <laughs> Start talking. <laughs> Send a prisoner to Mother Base. Equip the Fulton Recovery System. Select equipment by pressing the square or circle button while holding the L2 button. Oh, okay, so in this game, you don't need 
to Ultimate have a clear confirmed on board helicopter. So in this game, you don't have to have an open sky area for the Fulton recovery <laughs> system to work. Whereas in hmm? what's that noise? I don't know. What is that noise, man? You should come investigate. What was that noise? Guess not. Guess not. Hmm? Hi, buddy. Start talking. Good night, sweet prince. Hmm? What's that noise? What is that noise? Come find out. Hello. Start talking. Help? Okay. Right into the fucking wall. So. Oh, wait, I think I hear another prisoner. Is there another prisoner over there? I think I heard him. Oh, yes, hello, sir. Recovering a helicopter is complete. I think that's it for the prisoners. What's that? What's that? What was that? Guess not. Guess nothing. Enemy assault. Ruh row. Someone's firing at us! Going to alert status! Understood. Dispatching okay. reinforcements. Proceed with extra caution. What's that? Uh-oh. Guess not. Bye bye. <laughs> it just snuck past the reinforcements guy. He's like, enemy assault. The enemy is here. Rut row. Oh, they so they have special like M4s, not M16s. Interesting. Oh wait, is this a boss fight? Let's be continuing the next mission. Damn. So what is that? Is this like a... So is that a boss fight? Should I be gearing up for a boss fight in the next mission? Very nice. Only one alert phase. Uh-huh. Tiger Stripe naked. God damn it. Why can't I just get Tiger Stripe? Listen, boss. We both know you're the reason MSF's grown so much, but it's time we started putting more thought into provisions. Uh-huh. Right. A place this big needs a good stockpile on hand. The Japanese say you can't fight on an empty stomach, something we learned in World War II. Obviously. 
Maintaining a steady supply of provisions is one of the basic principles of logistics. So I went ahead and set up a mess hall team. The team members' numbers and abilities will affect the amount of grub to go around. Without enough food, morale will drop. They get hungry enough, and we could start losing people. Anyway, I need you to assign guys to the mess hall team. Got okay. That. Gotcha. So... So, mess hall team. Okay. Cool. Mess hall team. Yes! I got rank two. Let's go. Okay, we'll, we can skip all this. Okay. Staff. Waiting room. Uh, no. So you are gonna go into R&D, and you are going to go into mess hall. Um... Who else can join you in mess hall? You... can go into mess hall. And you can go into mess hall. Very nice. Weapons. Okay, so now we have this rank two, which uh, suppressor durability is increased, which is good. Let's park on another mission. Fuck it. I'm not sure how long this game is either. Like, I'm not sure if this is one of those games where it has like a three hour campaign and you're just supposed to keep like redoing it or what armored vehicle battle that's an armored vehicle unit snake either destroy the vehicle or neutralize the soldiers take it out okay Yes, sir, Tiger Stripe. We want... Analyzer. Um... I'm gonna unequip the love box. We have to eliminate all, neutralize all the guards or the vehicle, which is interesting. No need to take out the armored vehicle just yet. Neutralize the troops first. The accompanying soldiers are armed to the teeth. Watch yourself. Not enough room, huh? We'll keep it here at the base.
See, if this was Metal Gear Solid 5, I know exactly what I would do. I would fucking go sneak up on the tank and place a fucking C4 charge. I don't think you can really headshot these guys with Trank Darts, can you? Hmm. Um, hmm. What am I gonna do here? They're not really separating either. Which kind of really sucks. the play here. I feel like I should try, like, shooting one in the head and see what happens. take down these soldiers if I CQC them all. Or I kill them all. Which I don't feel like I should do. any way around just straight up shooting these guys, chat.
Where are my rations? There they are. How many rations do I have left? Two? Oh, fuck. Okay. So I have, like, I think I have to kill these guys. was kind of easier. I wish I didn't have to kill anyone, but you know, that's, 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 that's how it goes. Now there's a drone. Hmm. Holy fuck. It looks a lot different in game engine than it does in those cutscenes. Wow. I'm glad I got to see it rendered in-game instead of just in those comic cutscenes. Bro, bro. again. We fought. I didn't want Chico to know. Kept it a secret. Somoza's Guardia chased us out of Nicaragua. Across the Rio San Juan. And we ended up here. The only reason we've been able to keep on fighting. Amanda. The factory. You saw it? The banana factory. A front. It's a drug refining plant. The KGB set it up for us to run. We used the income to buy food and weapons. Uh, uh, mi viejo never said a word. 
But we all knew. Oh, everyone except Chico. Everything we have, our weapons, our compass, he brought it all together. We were going to rebuild our country. Rebuild Nika with our own hands. Yeah, her leg is Even fucked if up. We had to dirty our hands to do it. But it's all over. We lost our cacique. Papa. I could never replace him. Her leg is fucked up. Now they've taken the plant from us too. There's no place left to regroup. No way to fight la revolucion. Here. I rolled you one. What about you? You're going after that cargo? Yeah. Must be important, hmm? Hmm. Looks that way. It looks like it could be nukes. What? Nukes? Madre de Dios. No time to waste. We must get to Irasu. The transport route leads there. It must be where they're holding Chico and my compass, too. Whenever Chico and I argue, he goes off to be by himself. That's why he knows more than anybody about their bases. Whoa. He... He's got insider knowledge, chat. You're pretty worried about your baby brother. This is why I'm not fit to be a leader. Fine. It's a little bit out of my way, but just tell me where I need to go. There's a prison up in the mountains. That's probably where he is. A prison in the mountains. You must do something for me. If you can't save Chico, I want you to ease his pain, end his humiliation. Mm. I mean, we gotta go save Chico, Chico save right? If he's about to sell out his compass, please, at least let him keep his honor. That's a promise I can't make. Why? Amanda, we gave up our homes, but we're still alive. We're still fighting. And there's always another reason to keep on living. Uh, I feel alive again. Amanda, join my unit until you've healed up. Your unit? Yeah. Who are you? Why are you here? I'm Snake. Serviente. Snake? Could it be? The great cacique. She's wounded. Acknowledged. Kaz, the cargo on the barge. I was right. It's headed for the mountains. You think that's where they're taking the nukes? I'm sure of it. Let's move. Okay, so we gotta go save Chico. And then get up to the mountains to stop the nukes. But we gotta make it quick by the sounds of it. Let's go! Yay! I gotta see. Oh, we captured it. <laughs> That's pretty good. Tortilla chips recipe. 
Canned soft drink. Okay. Okay. Snake, Amanda's reached the planet. Snake. Amanda, how do you feel? Some first helicopter, right? I'll be perfectly happy if it's my last. As you can see, she's doing fine. I set Amanda up with her own frequency, so call her anytime you need to. If you have any questions about American bases or mercenary units, or about El Frente, just ask The fuck is El Frente? Please, do not forget my compass and Chico. Don't worry. It's good to be working with you, boss. Snake, we can monitor her condition in sickbay. Okay. Remember to assign roles to any POWs you bring back to Mother Base. How this outfit gets built depends on who we assign to what jobs. That'll determine how Mother Base grows. It's one of your most important roles, boss. Yeah, I know. Okay. Boss, one more thing. Now what? It's about sick bay. Naturally, we can use it for the sick or injured like we did with Amanda. But we can't expect people to get better without the proper treatment. Uh -huh. So I figure we'll need a medical team for that. The number of team members and their abilities will determine how quickly the sick and injured heal. They can also monitor everybody's health. Right. Prevention is the best medicine. You got it. Remember to wash your hands often and gargle twice a day, boss. If only I had the time. Medical team, sick bay, and she joined. Okay. Skip all that shit. Skip all that shit. Uh huh. Okay, right. So, RD, Max. New LAV, that's fine. We're gonna go to roster management, waiting room, no. But we do have the medical team and sick bay, so. Details. Oh shit! That's cool, you can actually like see the character. Okay, cool. You do that with the other ones? Like. <coughs> like Miller? No, you can't, okay. Right, so who is. good at medical? Hey, buddy, you're pretty good at medical. Alright. I think that's what we'll have for the time being. Okay. So I think we can do one more mission here. Before we're gonna be done with Peace Walker. Let's see what mission we're gonna embark on. Alright, so rescue Chico. Also, oh, all of these, um. Yeah, for some reason, I just can't do the extra ops, so we're gonna go ahead and rescue Chico. Nukes appear to have left the coastal marshes and reached the mountains around Irazu. But without a guide, it's going to be tough tracking those things in the mountains. So we need you to infiltrate one of their bases, a prison facility. I hope yeah, nothing's happened to Amanda's brother. I hear you. There may be other Sandinistas held there too. To bring them back safely to MSF, use the Fulton recovery system. As I'm sure yes, you sir. know from experience, it's completely harmless. After all, you won't have time to sit there and convince every single one of them to join. One other thing, Snake. Amanda. Those CIA bastards confiscated some of the houses in the village. Chico's got to be inside one of them. The houses, huh? How do I tell which ones? When they took over the houses, they installed new front doors for security purposes. The new doors are blue, with peepholes, so you can see what's inside. Blue doors. Okay. Got it. You're getting close to the end of the transport route. Good luck, Snake. All right. Uh, 
have any new weapons? I don't think we do. Okay. Mission prep. Let's go, baby. Do we want any more? I mean, Tiger Stripe is pretty good. So, we're gonna go ahead and just stick with it. Start mission! Also, by the way, I I've been sitting on a sponsored stream uh, invite for a little while, but I just... Uh, I'm, I don't know if I want to do it, because it's for the meme game Raid Shadow Legends, and I have to convince people to download the game, and I've never played the game before, and I don't want to take on that responsibility just in case if the game's bad. Like, I've, I haven't played it. How do I get up Wait. there? Who just spoke to me? Be imagining things. Oh, that guy just spoke. Not enough room, huh? We'll keep it here at the base. Okay, so there's there, there's the guard. That's that guy, Chad. That's that guy. Look, it's that guy. Ha! Start talking. <laughs> Start talking. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> Down you go. I see a guard man. Go ahead and sneak up on this guy. Actually, <laughs> fuck it. I'll just grab him now. Start talking. <laughs> I'll talk, I'll talk, all right? Yeah, start talking. Start talking. <laughs> okay. Completely exposed to sniper fire. I have a bad feeling about this. So you think I'm gonna get shot at by snipers? Okay. Bet. Big man. So I guess I gotta look up here for snipers. If you don't want your head blown off. You could probably climb that if you had someone to lend you a hand. something want to get this guy behind here can't be imagining things huh yeah come here big man nothing here can't be imagining things you kidding me bro I heard something. He's coming around this way. Can't be imagining things. Can you fucking come over here? Huh? He's not gonna come around this side of the box, is he? No, he's not. What a bitch. Can't be imagining things.
Fine, then I won't come around that side of the box then. Just gonna slowly move under the sniper. Okay, now we gotta wait for Big Man to turn around. Yep, start going the other way. Bye-bye. Bolton -bye. recovery helicopter is complete. Bye-bye. <laughs> okay, so in here is where Chico is. Chico's in one of these houses. You've got to find him, Snake. It's a blue house. Or blue door, excuse me. That's a blue door. Check inside a house by pressing the action button in front of the door. Uh. Who's there? Hey. Prisoners have been fitted with blue doors. Hmm. Wait for this guy to turn around before I hit this door to my right. Come on, big man. There we go. <laughs> Not this one. I found him. I found the lad, Chico. Huh. Who's there? Chico, it's me. Joy. Joy, that photographer. That's right, a war photographer. Huh? I thought you were here for the birds. Yeah, um, the birds of the battlefield. Whoa, is that chess? Can I see it? Wow, the same kind of chair used. You can't keep it, kid. Here, have these instead. Those photos! Huh. Oh no, Amanda! 
She's safe. Don't worry. Are you sure? We're patching her up back in my place. She's hurt? I said don't worry. It's just a broken leg. <sighs> you got any cigarettes? Mm. Hey, cigar, huh? Hey! Not for kids. Chico, do you know where they took the cargo? Cargo? What cargo? Let me rephrase that. How do they get stuff from the coast up here? Oh, that I can tell you. When the cargo gets to the harbor, they first send it up the marshes on a barge. Then, they load it onto a jungle train past the banana plantation and transport it by rail. Mm -hmm. The train stops here. When it gets to the train terminal past the coffee plantation, they reload it again. This time onto a truck, which disappears into a tunnel heading toward the mountains. Disappears? Chico, what's on the other side of that tunnel? Nobody knows. None of our compas ever got close enough. He's protected by a spirit. A uh, spirit? Yeah, a giant monster. El Basilisco. Hmm. The King of Snakes. No, 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 really, I saw it. I was camping up there one day, and just as I was waking up around dawn, I heard this loud noise. I opened my eyes and saw an enormous shadow. Must have been 30 bada at least. He was walking on uh. legs as big as trees. Where did you see it? At the terminal near the tunnel. Mm. But I only saw it that one time. What exactly were you doing there? I, uh... Well, me and my sister got into a fight. And you just happened to go camping. You know, their train should be arriving at the place I saw El Basilisco right about now. Is it far? No, really. Go past the coffee plantation, and it'll be to the north. Oh. What are you chasing? Hmm. Something that could keep the world in balance. Or destroy it. Huh? I heard that place was a narcotics plant before those guys took it over. But you already knew that, didn't you? Huh. Look, I get it. Even revolutionaries need to pay the bills. Still, must be tough for a kid like you to swallow. You're damn right it is. The route they use to transport stuff is the same one me viejo used to smuggle drugs. They sold the drugs to the Norte Americanos and used the profits to fund the army. They tried to keep it hidden from me. Hmm. Is that why you went camping? Yes. I managed to sneak into the plant a few times and... I tried to set it on fire. <laughs> Everyone treats me like a child. I, I, I couldn't stand it anymore. I'm not a kid, I'm 12. You're still a kid, but... could do it though, could you? Chico, growing up means choosing how you're going to live your life. To do the right thing, you sometimes have to leave the things you care about behind. Parents, family, your homeland. But mi viejo... Papa... Chico, look at the photos. Mi viejo... He's gone. But there's one thing you don't ever leave behind. Your memories. Keep them safe. You want to get out of here, Chico? I do, but... Come back with me. Your sister's waiting for you. I can't go back. I can't face everybody. You told them where your compas are. I see. <laughs> Nothing to be ashamed of. Pain gets the better of us all. <laughs> I wish I was dead. Hmm. Okay, then. I'll put you out of your misery. What? Any last words? Oh. Shoot, you are only going to kill a man. I 
just wasted a bullet. Don't waste your life. Listen to me, Chico. You died here today. You understand? You're hombre nuevo. A new man. Now, give that new life to me. Huh? Fight with me, little soldier. Show me how strong you really are. <laughs> Dry your tears, then promise me one thing. No smoking until you get older. Remember, real heroes are never as polished as the legends that surround them. You got it, boss. Uh, Snake is fine. What's that? <laughs> okay, he is recruiting a kid, but it's not like you think. If you've played through Metal Gear Solid 5, it clears up a lot of the child soldier like stuff. Um Big Boss does recruit children when he needs to, but he never forces them to fight. He lets them grow up and live normal childhoods and all that stuff. Like in Metal Gear Solid 5, there's a there's a time that we'll get to play through Phantom Paint. Yeah. Snake. So in Metal Gear Solid 5, Snake. Chico, you made it. Made it. Don't give me that. You say you're going to give me a new life, and then you nearly kill me. <laughs> I take it you didn't enjoy the trip. What's the big idea? Dragging me off in a balloon. I might as well have taken a Calibri. At least you got a nice view. Or are you afraid of heights? Whatever. I just wish you would explain it to me first. Would you have agreed to go if I did? Thank you for saving us, Snake. Amanda, a word of advice. What? Stop treating him like a child. Yes. Yes, I know. You're right. I shouldn't. Amanda, you're coming back after your leg heals, right? Of course. We still have work to do. We, huh? Are you sure you've got Chico's future in mind when you say that? What do you mean? We're sworn to our father's cause, to helping the revolution succeed. Revolution or no revolution, you pick up a gun and sooner or later you're going to hell. Are you prepared for that? I am. If the alternative is giving up the country I love, I'll take hell. Really? Well then, you're gonna have to stop treating Chico like a brother, and start treating him like a soldier. I... You're right. Welcome to hell. Snake, can I ask you a favor? Shoot. You find any prisoners from El Frente, you bring them back alive. Because... Hmm. You're trying to make amends for talking. Uh, not just that. Because they're compas. All right. But first, I've got to catch up to that cargo. I'll do whatever I can to help. Call me if there's anything you need to know about the area. And... And what? Let me know if you encounter any wildlife you've never seen before. Never seen before? What, like that Basilisco you were talking about? I'm talking about UMAs. UMAs? You know, like ancient dinosaurs or, or legendary <laughs> okay. One day, I'm going to be a hunter. Is that right? Okay, sure. If you want to know more, I'm happy to tell you. Right. I'll be in touch, Chico. Okay, Snake. The enemy's cargo is headed for the next outpost. A rail terminal. Chico says no one's ever set foot past there. Their main base is probably on the other side of that tunnel. Unless we catch those spears before reaching it, they'll be in enemy hands. You've got to stop mm. them. Hurry, Snake. Yeah. Snake, weapons and items development is going nowhere fast. Send us some more soldiers with the Fulton. Boss, I had an idea. Listen to this. Let me guess. You want to start running ads in the local gossip rags. Please, what do you take me for? I thought that with all the new guys we've got, we should get an intel team going. We'd send agents around the country to scout out different locations. That way we're better prepared, no matter where we end up. Hmm, that's actually not a bad idea. They could probably develop recon equipment for us too. We could also have them transport goods and direct the mother base support strikes. You can send an item to a co-op teammate from the delivery menu. 
Alright. Yeah, I do need to start faultening more people. The problem is, like... I'm just trying to get through the game. <laughs> support supply, support strike, database, yep, yep, yep. Intel team, Chico joined, yep, okay, we'll skip that, we'll skip that. Okay, let's get mother base crew people sorted, nope. Okay, so you are gonna go to R&D. Uh-huh, yep, Chico, you're gonna go to Intel. Right, Miller, I'm actually gonna swap you to mess hall. You guys all stay here in combat. Okay, boop, boop, boop. Yeah, no. So So how do I get her to... So when will she be better? She's at 46%? I don't know how to speed that up if possible. Um, database... Versus ops and delivery, okay. R&D, so we need rank three of R&D to make that better. I can make the 1911, but I honestly don't give a shit about the 1911, personally. We could make a sniper rifle. Hmm. All right. Well, I think that that is going to be a good place to stop Peace Walker for now. Uh, so far, I'm enjoying it. It's a big issue that I'm, and I'm sure maybe some other, I'm sure this would have been better if I actually played Peace Walker back on the PSP before Metal Gear Solid 5 came out, but the entire time I'm playing this, I'm just thinking of like, this is just mini Metal Gear Solid 5. Is just kind of what it feels like, but. but yeah, it's fun so far though. It's definitely really fun. Like, so I will.